Hey Canucks fans, big news. Goaltender Roberto Luongo has retired from the NHL after 19 seasons. Played most recently with the Florida Panthers, of course. Before that, the Vancouver Canucks. Before that, the Florida Panthers the first time. And before that, the team that drafted him, the New York Islanders. Luongo finishes right now third all-time in goalie wins behind Martin Brodeur and behind Patrick Waugh. He's a six-time NHL All-Star, a two-time Olympic gold medalist, 2010 in Vancouver course and 2014. And to me, he's my favorite Canucks player of all time. He personified the 2011 Stanley Cup run. He's personified the, those Vancouver Canucks teams from 06, 07, all the way to 2011, 2012, 2013, 2014, before he got traded. He was the heart and soul of the team. He was one of the leaders along with the Sedins and Burroughs and Kessler. But we lived and died with Luongo. You know, all the joys, all the pain, all the euphoria, all the frustration. We, all of us Canucks fans, felt it through Roberto Luongo, through his eyes, through his heart, through his play. He was an outstanding competitor, very competitive. He was uh, acrobatic, he was athletic, he was a good leader. That one year captaincy thing didn't work out so well, but it's hard to be a captain while you're a goalie. But overall, like I said, heart and soul of the team, that's why he was my favorite Canucks player of all time. He was, he is my favorite Canucks player and he certainly was my favorite, of course, when he was playing here. He got better with the media as it went on. You know, he was kind of had a prickly, uh, relationship with some of the media, but as he got later on in his career here in Vancouver, he got better with the media, became more self-deprecating in his humor, and he became very, very likable, especially on Twitter. But so, for so many reasons, off ice, but more importantly, on ice, all the contributions he's made to our team, uh, so thankful for Roberto Luongo and so grateful for his, his contributions here. There's this cap recapture thing because of that 12-year contract he signed under Mike Gillis, Mike Gillis here before the start of the 2010-2011 uh, you know, season. That's gonna have some ramifications on the Vancouver Canucks going forward. Basically $3 million a year gotta be allocated to this penalty because of the Luongo contract. But let's not rain on the parade. We have a lot of time to talk about that, the ramifications of the Canucks going forward. But for today, let's celebrate Roberto Luongo. Let's celebrate all he did for us as Vancouver Canucks fans. Have a great day, God bless. Go Canucks, go.